So you're in the middle of no one knows where. And you need to determine a base or a position on the ground in order to do your survey. The method that you'll use is PPP, also known as precise point positioning. The great thing about PPP is that it's a global service, meaning that you can use this service regardless of your location. The way this method works is, you'll first knock in a peg into the ground. You'll then measure the height from the top of the peg or the nail to the bottom of your receiver. Then you'll go into your ridge view application. So let's do that. The first thing, let's just make sure that we're connected to the correct receiver. As we can see, I am connected to the ridge B, which is our ridge base here. Now I will just go to my ridge view 3 and I can see that it is available. I'll click on it and it will automatically connect. It says connected. Now I'll just go to my logging tab. We'll stop all the previous recordings and then go into our settings tab. And underneath our settings, we'll see a variety of different PPP service providers. In this case, we can see Opus, Auspos, the Canadian CSRS system, uh, IBGE, and also any custom service that you might know of. So in our case, we will use the CSRS system as we have found it to be the most reliable for our specific area. The format is automatically selected to be Rhinex and the satellite is set to GPS and GLONASS. The logging interval is 30 seconds and then also our antenna height is 1.93 meters from the peg up to the bottom of our receiver. And our marker name is Nowhere One since we're in the middle of nowhere. So after that you'll click on apply and then you will start recording all your different data sets. After you have logged four hours minimum of PPP data on your base, we will then take that to the PC, submit it and just wait for our answer.